security and we are headed to the airport to fly to Milan to take a train to Como. It's like 4 something a.m. We have not been getting much sleep, but maybe the jet lag is serving us well. We are off to Milan, to Como, to eat pasta, to do everything. We just got to Verena. The train was a bunch of, yeah, with all the luggage, but we just walked into our room. I had no idea what to expect, and I'm like speechless. Freaking look at this view. Are you serious? Oh my God. It has like a full corner. You can't really see because this, but well, it's like a panoramic view of Lake Como. Like was absolutely not prepared for this. We literally just randomly found something on booking.com and we had no idea that it was going to be like this. Well, out for the day, I thought it'd be cute to wear a little dress. I wore some boots. Um, we just thought we'd have to drop our bags and go, but somehow the room was ready. And like I said, it has the most unbelievable view of the lake. Oh my gosh, and there's a bed up here, and there's a beautiful skylight. And so we're gonna wake up to this freaking view. Oh my gosh, we have to leave the windows open and wake up at sunrise, what do you think? My first bite in Italy. <laughs> first bite in Italy. I okay. Cutie. What? So something Callie and I saw on TikTok that I wanted the man to try his first time in Italy, we you add a little bit of salt to lemon soda. So let's see what we think. This looks absolutely unreal. Oh my god, we got pepper jelly with duck ragu. It's okay, and it has like pomegranate. And then we got gnocchi with fresh shaved truffle. This looks insane. Oh, look at this. Is this serious? So we just had a little wander around the town and our hotel, as you can see here, has its own little dock. And we are getting picked up here right now on our own little gyozo. Gyozo, gozo, 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 to do a sunset cruise and I cannot wait. If you want to feel like George and Amal, you can hire a private boat. And we do. And tour the lake. And do we? So they're gonna bring us wine. We're gonna do a little sunset cruise. We're staying in Verona and we're gonna have the boat drop us off in Bellagio, have dinner and then take the ferry home. So it's just really important to like mind the ferry schedule because we know the last one comes back at 11. And you just don't wanna get stuck way over on the other side of the lake. We also don't have reservations. So we're just gonna pop in and see what we can rustle up for dinner. Duh, it's gonna be perfect pasta. We haven't had our gelato yet. There's much to be done tonight. off where we're gonna have dinner <laughs> so that can happen too and if I look all bleary-eyed and teary-eyed it's because I cried tears of joy not once not twice but probably thrice wouldn't you have especially when your boyfriend like puts on your song over the little speaker yeah now we're gonna walk around and try to find a place to have dinner but he recommended one we should go for a drink at this little bar after look how cute that is oh it's so magical this is just Another level. <laughs> I don't think I understood. <gasps> yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Our uh, boat driver, he's a local, he recommended Suisse. So we're gonna go there. And then it's right here and it looks so freaking. Look at the little bicycle outside. Oh my god. What? Have in there? Oh my gosh. The shoot on melon must have. And then you 
you think I'm not going down for a wheel of Parmesan cheese that weighs more than half my body, you don't know me at all. <laughs> this is illegal. A little bit of melon. We're gonna wrap it up in this delicious ham. We're gonna feed it to you because it's your first time. How is it? I wish you could see his face. <laughs> so good, right? This place is so romantic. Look at this freaking adorable couple on this balcony. Uh, okay, this is strawberry and champagne risotto. You eat a bite and then you take a sip of the champagne. So let's do it. Here we go. So we said have a bite. Ooh, it does smell like strawberry. I'm losing it. <laughs> I'm so confused. I've never heard of this and it's so good. Mm. I'm way too cold. My hands don't work when I'm cold. So I just am bundled up and I'm just getting fed every bite and I'm not mad about it. I have a little bone in this brands, you know. But I will say, I did not expect it to be prepared like this. It's so simple. Delicate. One little potato, three little green beans, Shreds of fish, it looks so like whatever. The flavors are unbelievably immaculate. This is quality. And to finish the meal, obviously, we have to have espresso, tiramisu. I used to kind of put a little bit of sugar in my espresso, like when I was traveling, especially in Europe and stuff. And um, yeah, someone told me that you're supposed to just put the entire packet of sugar in this one little shot, and it seems like a lot, but we're just gonna do it. We're gonna do it. I've only had one, but I think I'm drunk on love, Italy. Don't worry, the man's in the bathroom, but even if he wasn't, we'd probably just both be here crying with happiness. I'm gonna stir it up. I'm just gonna take a tiny sip, because I'm gonna wait for the boy to come back from the bathroom, and then we're gonna eat tiramisu together, but... Okay, it really is. It just balances, like, I think, like, the, the acidity and, like, the strength of it. So good. We had we saw so many cute Italian people like doing the this today, <laughs> and it brought me a lot of joy. And that's all. Oh. Bomb. Oh my god. So. We were just saying this all just looks like a movie. Like we're just strolling along. These old freaking stone like castle walls with these exquisite manners and there's the boats and all the twinkly lights from across the lake. Even these little walkways have little old lanterns. Checked out and we're just having a little wander around our hotel and we've got a little serenade here. Huh? We just like can't even believe this is real as we're walking through. There's just so many beautiful little passageways and we're just walking through to go grab some coffee and lunch before we head to the train station. We just found this little most perfect alleyway with the water view. This just doesn't even seem like it's real. This sandwich is one of the best things I've ever eaten. It's like two pieces of like Italian bread with, there's like brie in between, right? It's like uh, grilled telegio. cheese oh, with telegio in between. A fried egg with like a jammy yolk, prosciutto, and other cheese layered on top. Persia. It's salty, it's like jammy and rich. It's yeah. the most satisfying thing I've ever made, and we definitely need to try to recreate this at home. Oh my god. So many beautiful like leather goods, purses, some really pretty jewelry. Found the best gelato place. We were wondering which one and apparently other ones have like more pre-mixed stuff and this is all fresh. He let me taste fresh fig. So everything is like, yeah, handmade with like local produce. So I ended up getting cherry and chocolate because had to. And you got... Pistachio and lemon. Pistachio and lemon. And it's so cute because you get to sit on these little cushions and eat it and look at the water. It's so sweet. This is 
so cute. I didn't know that they gave free Prosecco on these little um, first class trains, but they do. It's so cute. And we're riding at sunset and the sky is so beautiful. We're gonna arrive into Florence, just a little, a little bubbly. I'm so excited. Also, pizza chips. Also, where's my glass?